I guess we're just on an adventure. I like there's literally nothing I can do right now. We're just sitting here chilling. Something's gonna happen. Being out in the middle of the wa open water kind of makes me terrified, but it's cool. Hey, look, somebody left their TV. Actually, there's that's what all these things are. They're TVs, aren't they? What's up with everybody throwing their TVs into the ocean? Or whatever this is, lake? I don't know. Ice cream is the pinnacle of any dessert to you, though, Dandy. Chocolate peanut butter ice cream, to be specific. I don't think I've ever had chocolate peanut butter ice cream. I've seen it. It looks delicious. I've just never had it. I'd be down. Where are we going right now? Did I beat the game already? I'm just kidding, obviously. But, like, where the fuck are we going? Holy shit. That looks awesome. And ominous as fuck. Apparently, Drew beat Dorder Trade City last night on tactics on his first go. GG on that. I still need to go back and catch that because I basically decided to conk out when he was on his way to go f do that battle. So I didn't catch him actually do it. Dark chocolate ice cream? I think I've had dark chocolate ice cream. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's definitely sweeter than a normal dark chocolate, you know, thing. Is that the ship from the first game? I don't think this is a ship, Martin. I think this is like a city or something. Unless the ship is crashed and it's that large. It looks like a city or something. You used to like sweeter chocolates when you were younger, like nougats. You still like to eat them around Christmas time, but nowadays you like some crunch. Yeah, dude, I agree. I actually really... I, if I eat chocolate nowadays, I really like to buy like chocolate-covered nuts. So like cashews, almonds, peanuts, whatever. Chocolate covered is the shit. I like eating chocolate covered um, nuts. Yes, I said that. Anyway, hello, incorporeal friend. I will give you a hug, and you will assimilate into me for whatever, however that, re for whatever. I don't know. Did you know Finns are pretty beasty ice cream consumers per capita? No, I did not know that. Are you saying Finland is the ice cream capital of the world? Or ice cream consumption capital of the world? Hey, we got an achievement. We did it. All right. We're in there. You guys used to be, at least. You guys are just getting that ice cream and drinking that alcohol. Finland for the win. What is up with this per this, this is just clothes hanging above me, right? It's not a person. It looks just looks like clothes. Like empty clothes. It's very strange. I don't like it. Anyway. Let's see what's going on in here, shall we? Hello, hello. Yeah, I saw that it was hanging inside of a TV, but I didn't really understand what like what the fuck. You have some here that has pretzel sticks, Reese's Pieces, peanut butter chips, and peanuts. That sounds like a pretty good, nice little trail mix. Trail mixes are good because, again, they have the nuts and the chocolate usually, or nuts and some kind of sweet. I'm a fan. Should I go down the street? Is that an option? I feel like this is, like, giant exploration all of a sudden. You guys and your newfangled televisions everywhere. What's up with the TVs everywhere, man? Did people just decide TV fucking broke the world? Like, what the hell? So we're just gonna, like, TVs. The TVs took over the world. They became sentient. It's dangerously addictive trail mix if you enjoy peanut butter. Yeah. Peanut butter is delicious. I cannot deny this. I haven't had a lot of peanut butter lately. I'm kind of, I'm kind of slacking. Might be an anomaly or just places you visited, but you never noticed the drinking thing, Flammy. Like, there was a burger place in Helsinki where you could get a burger with champagne. Like, it comes with a glass of champagne, or they cook it with champagne or something. 
Did I just do like a cool slide move? Because that was kind of neat. Can I climb up this? Yeah. Climb. I can't climb. Come on. Fuck you. Alright. Yeah, funky. It was a typical thing to serve food with sparkling wine, even junk food. Okay, I see what you're saying. So they just serve they just serve it with wine. It's not necessarily like, hey, I drenched this burger in fucking champagne. Eat it. <laughs> TV's becoming sentient. Like a smart TV. Oh my god. We're already there. It's the smartest TV you've ever seen. The joke was right there, Martin, and I and thank you for pointing it out. I missed it. I overlooked it. No idea what I'm doing right now. I'm just trying to be explorational and finding a whole lot of nothing. All right, what's up with this pile of TVs? Can we climb it? No? Smart TVs. Can you still get a dumb TV? Sure. Every TV that's not a smart TV. That's a dumb TV. <laughs> it's called basic cable, okay? It's basic bitch-ass cable. Neat. I like how I didn't hook onto that TV. I just jumped into the hole. That was pretty cool. That was neat. That was awesome. Really happy I could do that. Is that a noose? It is a noose. And I was trying to jump up to hook onto it, but I guess I got to do it from atop this other TV. Ah! Fuck, that's a hole! Well, that's two deaths from this room because I'm being an idiot. <sighs> Let's stop doing that. You never played any of these games, but they seem oddly atmospheric in an eerie and unsettling way. That's why it's called Little Nightmares. Unsettling Little Nightmares. Key up! Oh, shit. Well, I was going to jump off, and then the kick thing happened, and then everything got fucked up. So we're supposed to kick it down. I get it. I understand. I fucked up. Let me try that again the proper way after three deaths. You're in the middle of playing the new Ratchet and Clank game at the moment? Well, you can play this later, then. This kind of reminds you of that black and reminds you of that black and white game you don't recall? You're definitely thinking of Limbo, which I mentioned earlier. This game and the first are very much inspired by a game like Limbo for sure. You like the Tim Burton vibes? Reminds you of Nightmare Before Christmas? I could see that. I see that, Sparty. I see that one. That I see. Ah, okay. Friendo, are you ready for a ride of your life? Oi. Noise. We work together. This feels like it could have been made as a two-player game, doesn't it? I'm surprised this isn't two players. I feel like it could have been. Wasted opportunity to be a co-op puzzle game. Wasted opportunity. Are we going to do this again? Oh, we're doing this again. Oh, boy. Here we go. Yeah, Kia! Oh, God. <laughs> The sound when I hit the ground, though. Just... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm fucking... I'm, I'm, I'm fucked up, man. I'm fucked up. Uh, yup! Yeah, let's actually press the grab button again. I pressed it, but it was too late last time. I was like, oh, shit. I keep forgetting to hold down the grab button when I jump like that. It's my own fault. Damn it. Okay, so I can probably cross here, but what's over here? This is where the kid got up to here, isn't it? Was there anything over here? Oh, there's one of these. Hello. Huggy, huggy. You're kind of miffed that you can get re-released games like Another World and Flashback almost on every platform now, but no one has really done spiritual successors, to your knowledge. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's games that are like those games that exist. Maybe you just haven't noticed them? I don't know what kind of game Flashback is, but Another World? I feel like there's games out there that are like that. If anything, I would say, isn't that game Inside I played last week kind of like that? Like, it may not be quite as primitive 
I feel like games that are that old style are better now because they don't have as bad of controls. <laughs> like the controls are better now. People are take take time to make the controls better so the game doesn't feel as janky. Like try like the trial and error is still there, but it's not as hard to figure out. I guess is what I'm saying. Because games like this are that kind of style, in my opinion. It's just. I'm talking about another world, not necessarily flashback, because I don't know what kind of game that is. Oh boy. Oh god, the brainwashing TV is on. No wonder people are destroying their TVs. I'm gonna die. My head's going to explode. Oh shit. Uh, am I supposed to walk toward the TV? Maybe? I guess so. I am. It's happening. Break it. Oh shit, what the fuck? Oh, it's like that twisted corridor from the beginning of the game. Press L to tune a transmission. Or use L, rather. Oh, I see. Weird. I, I did it, I guess? Or wait, there's more to this. Holy shit. Okay. Fucking the ring all over again, man. I'm gonna run if I can. It's all slow motion. Slow motion. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Well, that was an adventure. Are you saying that going in the TV was a bad thing? Maybe. Well, now we're getting into the weird shit that this game has to offer. Weird shit. <laughs> Moving on. To the trash! Yay. Alright. Of course, Flammy played the game Flashback on an Amiga, on a SNES, on a Genesis, on a Switch. Again, I've never even heard of that game, so I'll have to look into this flashback game just to see what it is. And uh, again, I've never played Another World either, but I'm a, I'm vaguely aware of it. Okay. Well, here we are outside again. Oh, what? Uh, we gotta move. We gotta move this dumpster. I see the hole. Move it. We gotta move this dumpster, kid. Come here. Come here. We're gonna move this dumpster. This way. Oh, you know what? We're gonna pull it. That's what we're gonna do. Never mind. Here, here. Let's pull the dumpster. I don't know why I thought I could push it to the side. That seems silly. I don't think we have to pull this that far, do we? Like, what would be the point of keep pulling this? Probably nothing. So I could pull it all the way back over here, but it wouldn't serve us any purpose. Yeah, I would say old old PC games are notorious for not working properly on any PCs. Like, I had some myself. Granted, I had a terrible PC back in the day. Like a Windows 98 piece of shit. And I, I got some old games that I could never figure out how to get them to work. And I always wanted to try them. I was pretty annoyed by that. But Age of Empires worked, and that's all I gave a shit about. Age of Empires was my shit. Oh, cool. It's an orphanage, probably. Great. It's either that or it's a school. Okay, I guess it could be a school. I'm calling it an orphanage by assumption, just because it has the playground. But I guess it could be a school. Dude, let's seesaw. Let's seesaw together. No? You don't want to seesaw with me? Bro, let's seesaw together. Bro, seesaw with me. There we go. Let's seesaw. He doesn't want to seesaw with me, dude. What a lame -o. You spent a lot of hours playing Transport Tycoon Deluxe. 
that doesn't even sound like a lot of fun. But you know what? I played a lot of weird, you know, simulator shit back in the day. I'm pretty sure I played Sim Farm a little bit. I played that Sim Theme theme Hospital or whatever it was fucking called. I wish I would have played those more, to be honest. But I didn't own those ones myself. I played those at my cousin's house. Wait, is there a point in getting up here on this bench and sitting down? Well, hope you enjoy your bench sit. I'm out. See ya. Hi. Played the crap out of Zoo Tycoon and Age of Mythology. I also got to play Age of Mythology. It would not run on my computer, which pissed me off. But my homie got a newer computer, and we played it at his house. And I liked it. And then his house got robbed, and he someone stole his computer, and it had my disc in it. So, rip to Age of Mythology. Now, I have, I have bought it on Steam. I do have it. But I haven't played it yet. I've played Age of Empires 1 and 2 quite a bit. i played Age of Empires 3 a little bit. I need to finish that game too. But Age of Mythology have not pop popped on yet. I need, to, I need to play that too. I love that game. The Age of Games from back in that era are the bomb. Alright. We're in, dog. We're in. I'm not sure if this is a school or an orphanage yet, but we're in. Wait. These shoes are actually my size. Fuck your shoe. Alright, this feels like a school because it's got like the backpacks to hang your shit up and stuff. It feels like more of a school. What's up with these terrifying pictures of all these humans? If they're even human. You just remember laughing so hard at patients throwing up at random and the noises they made on the toilets? Are you talking about Theme Hospital? Yes, Gorilla. That game. That game was fun. Again, I wish I played it more. But I never really got the chance. I could always go back and play it again someday. I never played Two Point Hospital. Isn't that the new one? Or is that actually a remake of a new, an old game? Because I know they have Two Point Hospital on like new consoles and stuff. <clears throat> they have old Theme Hospital on GOG. Nice. There's a lot of those old simulator type games which would kind of be fun to pop open for a stream just to check out, you know, kind of relive the memories. Might happen someday. Just too many games out there to play, man. Sometimes I got to settle for these experiences that I can play the whole game. It's like, I know it's going to be like an eight hour experience. I'm going to beat the game and then we're going to move on. It's hard to play a simulator where I'm like, I want to keep playing this. Oh, I want to keep playing this. Oh. I keep doing this slide and I don't even know how. Wanna play ball? Wanna play ball with me? Wait, what? What is he doing? Hello? Uh. <laughs> I wanna be like, you wanna carry things too! What is happening? Well, I don't know why we were carrying those things, sir, but we carried them. We did it. Fuck this doll! Fuck this jar. Yeah, fuck that jar. I don't know why I broke that jar. I just felt like it. Oh, shit, I can climb up here. Well, sort of. Not really, though. Uh, was there a purpose to this room? Doesn't seem like it. Maybe. I can't climb up onto the bed. Well, then I guess we'll just go. No, no, don't close the door. I'm trying to go out the door. There's also this lesser-known game called Music Chase, The Music and Me. It was a point-and-click puzzle. Whoa. Sorry. Things are falling in my foreground. I thought they were in the background. Uh, it was a point-and-click puzzle where you found musical instruments that had Guitar Hero-style gameplay. Huh. Interesting. You remember you get a Chivo for chucking a paper plane out the window? Was there a paper plane over here? Hold up. Hold up. Was there a paper plane? Oh, are you thinking of a different game, Scorilla? Oh, it's behind the rubble. Oh, well, whatever. I didn't see it. Moving on. Unless I can't find out where to go. Am I supposed to do something in that room?
Oh wait, I never did pull this. Oh, this is a good idea. Into the darkness. What's the point of standing here? Is this a bad idea? I feel like this is a bad idea. This game's way freakier than the first one. Oh boy. Can't wait for it to get more freaky then. Because running from the dude with the gun was, you know, it was it was scary. It wasn't that scary. It was it was it was intense. That much is true. Oh, there's a paper airplane right there. I see it. Okay. Oh, okay. Neat. I didn't know you could actually, like, throw that shit. But the window's not even open, right? Do I have to open the window? Unless there's another... You mean there's, like, another window in a different spot? Because I don't think I'm able to, like, throw it. The window I came through? Okay. Well, I have it now. Fuck it. I know it's just an achievement, but why not? I like throwing paper planes. Let's go throw it. I will say it's significantly more eerie in this bitch now that it's dark. I don't know why we wanted to make it dark. I don't know what purpose that served. Anyway, paper airplane. See ya. Oh, hit the wall. Let's try that again. Fucking see ya. Yeah, fly free. Flee and the wind blows. All right, we did it, y'all. We threw the paper plane out the window. Are you proud of me, Mom? No, actually, I don't have a hangover today, Frog, surprisingly. I thought I would feel like shit, but I took some aspirin, drank a bunch of water before I went to sleep, and I'm feeling pretty all right today. I'm, I'm like, I, I was hungry. I was thirsty when I woke up, but otherwise, actually, I wasn't that hungry. I take that back. But I was thirsty as fuck. I needed water really bad when I woke up. Anyway, I feel like everyone has at least played one hidden object adventure game in their life. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I have Dandy. But yeah, the aspirin and water move. And plus I ate after the stream as well because I hadn't eaten dinner. So I did all those things when I finished stream. I'm a little confused on what to do right now. Like, is there something I'm supposed to do in the light? With this projected light? I, I don't understand what I'm doing right now. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe I'm supposed to put some object in that spot in the light at like 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 maybe that ball like this ball right here this probably this ball was prominently featured when i walked in so let's try this and if it's not the ball i'll find something else but i'm not sure what else to try i well, think like why else would there be a light in a specific spot Maybe it's something else. This ball likes to roll. Hmm. Well, I'm going to assume it's not the ball. Let's try find something else to put there. It's got to be something from this room, right? Maybe you just have to stand there. I did try that, Martin. I'll do it again. Maybe I need to put this can... You want my canned goods? All right, I'll just stand here. I tried this already. It didn't seem to do anything. Is 
Still doesn't seem to be doing anything. So, yeah. I'm assuming I'm missing something. What would it want me to put into the motherfucking thing? What's that symbol right when you are on the wall? What do you mean? What symbol? You mean like when the game's auto saving? Well, we have a spoopy doll. Maybe we could go put the spoopy. Oh god. What the fuck? Don't do that ever again. I didn't even throw it. It just floated on its own. That was not cool. <laughs> that was not cool. <laughs> that was not cool. You want my creepy baby? Maybe I have to hold it up into the light like this. Whatever object it's supposed to be. Let me get that baby again. Hold up. Yeah, because see, he like holds it up. Alright, let's leave it sitting there. Okay, well, I'm going to go with no. Where'd that ball go? You dislike this image? What if I hold... Oh! Get the fuck out of the way! Fucking doll. Maybe I just have to hold the ball into the light? No? Fuck you! Oh! Sh so... That's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> I can't believe that worked! I did that out of spite and it worked. That's hilarious. Well then. Whoo. For future reference, holding something up is a prompt for a target. Oh. Okay. I thought maybe I was like holding up this light because the thing was going to activate or something when I held it up. I don't know. I don't know. That makes sense though. Anyway, this room looks fucking terrifying. Somebody gets tied to a chair and they fucking feed them. To force feed them with a spoon? I mean, that sounds like fun, right? Oh, shit. Yeah, it looks like a torture room to me, sir. Anyway, we're about to fucking go like this! Oh, wait. Let's do that again. Brendo! There we go. Teamwork! I like how the homie got the gist. He's like, oh, okay, we stomped this bitch. Let's go. Stomp that shit. Hey, yo, DJ, stop that shit. Oh, there was a mallet and a saw in the background. That room looked like a fucked up torture room. For sure, Martin. For sure. Key up. Ooh, I probably need to just drop. Uh. 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 We are a Yankee, Yankee Yank. You don't believe me they were there? Or you don't think that makes it a torture room? Neither, Martin. I agreed with you that they're there, and I agreed that that was a torture room. What are you talking about? <laughs> Oh, cool. This sounds fun. I love the scraping noise. Awesome. This is going to be fun. Yup. Who it is. Who that is. Well, I don't know yet, but we're going to go have fun with whoever it is. Time for a creepy school jaunt. A jaunty creepy school uh, uh, vacation, right? Awesome. There's a duck inside this bucket. I want it. It's a ducket! A duck in a bucket! That is a duck, right? It won't let me even interact with this, surprisingly. What the? Wow. I thought the game actually riveted at me for a second. Nice one, Flammy. <laughs> <laughs> 
KFC. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, I fell for that one. <laughs> oh, that was good. That was good. Holy shit. That was good stuff. <laughs> uh, duck in a bucket is KFC, right? No, that's chicken. But sure, Martin. Sure. This is some Home Alone shit. Oh, fuck. It's another child. It's another child. I'm scared. I don't want to play with another child. Children scare me. Can I use this to hit the duck in the bucket? The duck it? Wow, let's just not even throw it at that. This is the place where you croak. You right. Wow, okay, apparently that's a no. Quail in a pail. Duck in a buck. Almost. He's just a very strong thrower. Yo, you want to see two points? Two points? Oh, uh, zero points because I missed. Hit that layup, though. Yeah. I don't even know if that did anything useful. It, did, it, did, it definitely didn't. But yeah, let's go destroy the child. That's what we need to do. Chase the child, destroy the child. He's a child. He needs to be destroyed. Because I said so. I already have a child friend. I don't need another one. One child friend is enough. Because who ever heard of having two best friends? I knew it. Oh, shit. The double whammy. Okay. The double home alone whammy. Hey, Funky, you can't have enough children. Emergency food. You right. Fucking children. Let's go into the bathroom, no? Can I not push this door? Hello? Oh, there it is. Oh my god. Fucking home alone ass bullshit. Who's, who has a bucket? Oh god. What did that do? I thought there was something else that was going to fall on my head. Fucking bucket of shoes. Someone literally had a bucket of shoes. Asshole. Asshole. Oh boy, predators here too. That child predator. Ah, good times. Anyway, get the child. Get him. Oh shit! Did you see me avoid that like a champion though? I literally just kept running because I saw that it was gonna happen. Uh, oh, it's one of those monkeys that does the clapping thing with the symbols. I know those. Okay. Neat. See that child try to fucking trick me? What an asshole. Am I right? We sneaking in here? You can never hide from me, child. Actually, we could probably just jump over this. What am I doing? Well, the doorknob's gonna be electrified or heated up, probably. Fucking home alone ass bullshit. Oh, that that duck's not a trap. Totally. Hmm. Can we spring set trap? Give me something to throw at it. No. Okay, well. I tried to duck. I tried. I tried to duck when I grabbed the duck and it didn't work. I pressed it, but apparently holding on to a duck doesn't let you duck. Yeah, see? That duck quacked at me. Fucking duck. Quack. I like how that was like a symbolism for duck, bitch. You gonna get clotheslined right now. I had a feeling it was. I just I was holding the duck instead of ducking. That didn't work. I'm waiting for this creepy crawly fucking bitch that way we heard with the scraping sound to show up. This, but we have to chase the child for a bit first. Oh, you're an asshole. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's a lot of creepy children. Oh, shit. Come back, homie. Oh, poor homie, dude. 
Dude, poor homie. Also, they might just be dolls since their faces were cracked open and shit. Not all of them, though. Just some of them. They did kind of remind me of, like, Pinocchio from, like, Shrek. Speaking of dolls, there's one right there. Who's ready to get fucked up? Fuck your shit! Well, then. That, that happened. <laughs> Fuck your shit! Crushed his fucking skull in. Like a goddamn zombie. Get fucked. You wanna fucking take my friend? Wait. This is about to be a trap. Oh, motherfucker. I didn't know it was gonna come from behind me. That's fine. I can I can make that happen. God damn it. Alright, that's fine. At least I get to have the satisfaction of crushing this guy's skull in again. That was a good time. So fuck you! And your dumb head too, bitch. They basically are porcelain dolls, you are correct. So I think if I like run through here. Can we set this down? Get fucked, homie! If you see Chucky, I think you're fucked. Oh hell no. Nah. I'ma fuck some shit up with my goddamn hammer. I'm gonna show bitches who's who the fuck the boss is. Oh dude, he was eating a frog or something? Like what the hell? He's literally tearing open a frog. That's not cool, homie. I don't think I can take this hammer with me, unfortunately. I feel like we haven't had a new hat in a while. Oh yeah, I murdered his ass. There was a hat in the playground? Shit, really? Damn it. I figured I missed one, because it felt like I should have had a new one by now. I need a key for that. Nah, it's okay if I miss hats. This is a blind playthrough. I'm just trying to, you know, if I find stuff on my own, cool. If I miss it, oh well. Oh boy, time to start dealing with some adults again. Can't wait for this. Yeah, not a big fan of what's coming up here. Here we go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wow. Wow. Was there a way to not trigger that? Because holy shit. I didn't expect him to go straight up like, wee and just fucking just jump on my ass. Like, I got fucking torn shreds, man. Okay, now go. All right, and we'll wait right here. This bitch gets like writing some shit on the chalkboard or whatever. I'm just gonna stay right here. So you turn your bitch ass around, you whore. I like that she's blurred out to keep it just creepy enough so you can't see her face. Get the fuck out of here, play. See ya. Alright, there's the key I'm looking for, bitchin'. How do I get it? It's actually hard to tell what kind of dolls they actually are. Is this true? Oh, fuck. Well, that happened. <laughs> I didn't even... I, I couldn't even react fast enough. I was just like, oh, fuck, I'm dead. Run. Run. Oy vey. What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay. Yep. That's not terrifying. Yep.
Who? <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. Yeah, me too. Uh... <laughs> I was not expecting the extendo necko situation o <laughs> Got neck for miles, girl. Girl, you got neck for days. Oh, fuck me. Don't you dare go out there yet. Wait till this... Oh, my... Look at her face. You know what? Don't look at her face. It's terrifying. Keep an eye on this bitch, like for real, though. What? How the fuck did you see me? Oh, that's fucked up. I was hiding. What a bitch. How did she see me back there? I was like in the shadow behind another desk, ducked down. How the hell did she see? That was lame. <laughs> I probably could have got away. I just panicked and I didn't know where to go. Oh, maybe I should have went under the desk. That might have been safer. Her awareness is pretty crazy high. I seem like it. Maybe under the desk was my answer. I think that probably would have been smarter. Under the desk, you'll never find me, bitch. She feels the vibration in the air with her neck muscles. Not moving, not moving. Don't fucking move, player. Fuck out of there as fast as possible. Not gonna stick around. Fuck that. See ya. See ya. Woo. See ya. Alright. She must have a lot of those neck muscles to be fair. True the fuck that. There's a lot of neck there to have a lot of muscle. Imagine the deep throat game though. <laughs> For real, though, Skorilla. For real, though. <laughs> Thought it would have been BS had she seen you through the desk. Yeah, uh, she didn't see me through the desk. I was not under the desk the first time, so I'll allow it. Aw, oh, man. Another one of these porcelain fucks. Can I murder him? I probably don't want to aggro him. Oh, shit. He's chained. <laughs> Dick. You dick fuck. Yeah, hope you choke yourself to death, you stupid porcelain piece of shit. Do it again. Ha ha. Piece of shit. I'm done dealing with you. Wait, am I? Uh, maybe I'm not. I feel like we need him to, like, break this open for us. I mean, all I have over here is some fucking shoes. I should have just made it so it breaks after three th tries to make the fair player feel safe. That would actually have been pretty funny if they did that. Alright, hold up. He did have it. There, there is a thing on the ground over there. I just saw it. Oh, shit. Oh, come on. That was booty. That was booty as fuck. Get out of here. He didn't fucking grab me. Get the fuck out of here. I 
I wanted to see if I could smack him. Can I smack him? I'm not even trying to hit the wall right now. Oh, son. Get fucked. Piece of shit. That's all I really wanted. All right. And there you go. Yeah. Get fucked up, homie. All right. Good times. The eyes he drew on the ground are very creepy. I know, right? That's kind of what I was looking at to see what he was drawing. It's just a bunch of eyeballs and scribbles and shit. I don't feel bad. I cave that bitch's skull in. He tried to fucking eat me, asshole. He got what he deserved. He wasn't hurting nobody except for me. Fuck that. Fucked his shit up. Fuck your can. Alright, what do we have next? What kind of fun situations await us? Hello? Can I jump high enough, please? Thank you. Oh, good shot. Good fucking job, dude. Good fucking... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't realize it was her. Oh, hell no. <laughs> I got ate like a motherfucker is what just happened there. Oh, my God. Okay. I see. We're supposed to hide in here. I didn't actually see this box. Creepy ass long neck bitch. I think you can't avoid making noise those two times. Never skip neck day. <laughs> yeah, I think twisted representations of adults is a perfect, a perfect example. Like this is a kid having a nightmare and these are the representations of adults that he has. I feel like that's a pretty good like explanation for what we're witnessing here. Not gonna get me predator. Not gonna get me. Hold up. Not sure if lore is spoilers. No, you don't have to confirm or deny any of that. I was just pointing out that that's kind of what it feels like. So if that's whether that's the case or not is irrelevant. We'll find out later. Oh, we're going to have to run. Can I hide here? She won't see me here. Oh, wait, there's a box. Ah, get in there. I didn't realize I could go in that box. Whew. Yeah, Dandy and Flammy are going in blind, so I'm okay with them asking questions like that. I figured I figured that's what they were referring. Like, they don't know what they're actually talking about, so it's fine. Oh, I can't climb up here? Really? That's actually a surprise. All right, well, let's get the fuck out of this situation. Because obviously we've already mentioned that you played this first gorilla, so... I, yeah, I'm trying to stay away from actual, like, c confirmation of anything until we get into it. Find out more. Reminds you of the three-headed worm from Half-Life 1? Mm, not really. She reminds you of an Alolan Executor. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Oh, God. There she is again. Just here to fucking haunt my library visit. I just wanted to have a fun library visit, but no, this lady had other ideas. I just wanted to enjoy my visit to the library, man. I 
I mean, it probably wouldn't have been that big of a deal if you did explain it, Squirrel. I mean, if it's lore stuff, but like, even so, I'd probably rather like actually see if we can kind of imply it, get the lore implied from the game, and then you know we can have things being explained when we beat it. Because I'm okay with knowing that stuff. Just I, I, I kind of want to let it like, take it all in for what it is first. Kind of have my own thoughts on the process and not know exactly what's going on here. Wait. That's a hat. There's a fucking hat up there. Uh-uh. We ain't leaving that. I just realized that's a fucking hat right there. I saw it just barely, but I think that's a hat right there, boys. Boys. That's a fucking hat. Let's fucking go. You're over here molding because I fucking almost missed a hat. It's a bucket hat or a can hat? I don't know. It's a metal head. Now we're... I guess it's a can. It looks like a tin can. So now I got a tin can head. Nice. Well, Funky, I hope that in this game you are a hat. Can I get a pyramid head? Oh, shit. Hold on. I ain't got time for chat right now. I just aggroed. I just aggroed. Ah, I'm dead. Well, see ya. Well done. Can a matchbox? No, but a tin can. Oh, my God. <sighs> Am I playing guitar? No. Um, I do have this hat. If you want to count that as a pyramid head hat, um, that's all I got. Based on these silhouettes, though, this is as pyramid as we're going to get. All right, run for your life. Run for your life, kid. Oh, shit. Run for your fucking life, kid. Woo. Run, bitch. Run. She going to kill you. Climbing, I'm climbing up, right? You really gonna summon country fuck to deal with this fucking bumpkin ass lady who likes to deep throw for a living? Man. Okay. Country funk here. Tuning in. Or, uh, here once again. Hoping not to get deep throated by this crazy long neck demon lady. She's pretty terrifying. I would never want to go to school with this, my teacher. Mm -mm, I'll be staying home every day. I hear about these kids. About, these teachers always trying to have sex with their students and shit. I don't think this teacher be doing that because she'd be busy eating them completely and utterly and their entire motherfucking life is gone. Flash before their very eyes. Mm -hmm. Me over here just trying to play the video game, getting fucking eat alive and shit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I tell you what, I, I tell you what. She's busy taking the out from eating out. She's only eating. She looked like she like a long neck beer. Oh my god. Can we have any more neck jokes before my neck before I want to snap my own neck jumping off the fucking building and hope I land on my head cuz holy shit these jokes there's something. Not sure what to do next, but I'm going to go ahead and no, no, no. Y'all wanna if y'all wanna talk about breaking somebody's neck, y'all need to put y'all need to go into your Spotify playlist and bust out that Buster Rhymes Break Your Neck. That is a good song. I used to bump that shit back in the day when we we were rolling down the road, bumping that shit. Mm-hmm. Can't imagine trying to sing sing some Buster Rhymes with a country accent. I can't even. I can't even. Can you imagine? I can't even imagine. I was like, "Break your neck! Come on, break your neck!" See, I can't. I can't sing with a country accent when it's a rap song. It's just not natural. It just sounds weird. You know what I'm saying? At this point, I'm a little flabbergasted and not sure what to do. Maybe we'll just pull this bucket of books over here and see what we can do with this. What entire nation I'm supposed to do up in this, I don't really know. Maybe I can use this to reach the door, huh, Nob, so we can get into the door that she went into? Maybe that's what we need to do. Mm-hmm. 
country ho. Take me to the place where I belong. Here we go. Just gonna follow. Ho <laughs> ho. Better watch out. Long neck lady gonna eat you alive. Mm hmm. I'm certain we haven't fleed the likes of her. Although my biggest curiosity right now is where the fuck is my friend gone? My friend has got to be here somewhere. Mm hmm. I tell you what, if we ain't save my friend before I leave, this is gonna be a failure of an operation. This school is fucking nightmarish enough, but if I have to do it alone, then might as well give up on life. Although we started the game alone. That's a locked door right there. Mm -hmm. If I had that Harry Potter spell, I would bust that shit out. But alas, I haven't visited all of Anders to learn to get my own wand. So we are stuck at finding the actual key. Oh, well. Do, do, do. Oh, shit. I didn't even see that guy there. He was busy wigging out, and I was just ignoring his ass. I'm sorry, friendo. I meant to absorb you into my my uh capillaries or whatever they're called mm-hmm capillaries suck it in them 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 demon children changing my life forever mm-hmm what is this what is this? what tarnation is this contraption didn't aggro nobody so i don't even care i don't even care this is a giant chest piece that's what this is mm -hmm. that's a pawn that's a broken in half piece Cap a Larry, so it's a hat. Ooh, not that don't sound wrong. Can I can I can I can I move this chess piece? Maybe we can move it so we can win the game, if you will. I'm actually not too sure what I should be doing right now. I see a big Oh shit, dude, I fell down them stairs and now I'm a dead little boy. I hope you didn't get a game over for that, because holy shit. If anybody... I told you I wanted to break my neck. Well, that's, that's the easiest way to accomplish that. All you got to do is just throw yourself off a balcony and boom, broken neck. Maybe I was supposed to put this piece back together like that, and now it's a rook, and I can use it to climb up and open the door. Oh, I see, I see. I see, I see. hey -ya! Oh. It might help if you hold down this fucking correct button, you stupid-ass country bumpkin. There you go. How hard was that? Who's ready for a lifetime, a life-size, a life-size chess game? Hillbilly Funk is back again. <coughs> oh, shit. <coughs> okay, I need to stop. That voice, for some reason, was destroying me. <coughs> I gotta stop. Oh, my God. Whew. Glad you enjoyed the voice. Also, hold up. Is it pizza day? Ooh. I think my sister's going to order some pizza. Pizza, 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 pizza. Sorry for that cough. That shit fucking... Just like, it built up as I was doing that voice and then it just hit me. <clears throat> Told you that lingering cough is not completely gone. It's super annoying. And if you're asking if I can do, like, the Hank Hill voice, is that what you're asking, Clammy? Like, what in Tar Nation? Or, uh, damn it, Bobby. I don't really have a Hank Hill. I can't do it proper. Also... I just realized <laughs> this chess piece has one of these porcelain dolls, like, strapped to it. That's fucking funny. What about Italian funk? The only Italian accent I can do regularly is the fake-ass Mario one that's racist as fuck. So I don't qualify that as actual Italian. <laughs> Who's the king now, bitch? <laughs> Basically. <laughs> Alright, I think I have to get these like chess piece heads on back onto their pieces correctly i guess like here's the actual white king is up there <coughs> i think i need to use one of the other pieces to get up there though 
Actually, can I um, take this rook head and use it again? Totes can! I am smart. Reuse your shit. <laughs> he is the king, but at what cost? You understand. I know some female streamers that do more convincing hand kill. Yeah, I don't. I don't have the hand kill. I I don't watch enough King of the Hill, so that's a big reason why I don't have his voice down very well. <coughs> like I don't even have the cadence of his voice because I've never really practiced it. It's definitely something. If I really wanted to do it, I probably could, but it would take some practice. <clears throat> I just solved half the puzzle. What, getting getting the fucking... I'm assuming getting the rook head was like a big part of solving that. Oops. Oh. Okay. What did that do? I have no idea what that did. I truly, truly don't. Oh, I never went over here. Hello. Hello, creepy eyeball painting. Oh, hey, look, it's a it's the queen. I'm guessing we're taking the queen's head off. Yes, we are. We're going to go take the queen back where she belong. <clears throat> oh, maybe it's like check for the solution once you have it. Yeah, that's true. That could be. Could be. Man, now you're going to make me do the old man voice? Well, at least the cough will be proper for the old man voice. Well, the old man voice has been summoned again. And that's good because old men, they're, they're pretty much masters of the chess. So hopefully I can use the powers of my old school mentality to play some proper chess up in this bitch. Looks like I'm still missing one of the chess piece heads to be able to finish solving this shit. It's not so much that the old the old man voice is actually pretty easy for me to do these days, cause I I've practiced it quite a bit, so don't worry about my voice while I'm doing this. I'll be fine. I'll just be I'll just be over here trying not to cough like an old man usually does. Ah, there's a solution to your problems right there. It doesn't look like I need to do much more, actually. I think I have the pieces exactly where they need to be. So let's just go ahead and turn this bitch in and solve that motherfucking puzzle, you know what I'm saying? <coughs> it looks like Captain Funky has solved the puzzle again. He puts the powers of old mad wisdom wisdom to the to the to the test. Pick up the key, you fucking pleb. <coughs> Back in my day we didn't need keys to open doors. We would just visit Hogwarts and use our spell books and use the wand, you, you know. <coughs> That's two Harry Potter jokes with two different voices. Suck on that one. That's the same Harry Potter joke with two different voices. You love when Funky's channels J and and Silent Bob is an old man? <coughs> Don't you quack at me, you fucking duck. I'll fucking murder your bitch ass. All right, so we have the key that we need to make progress. Let's head back on out and open up that door. And hope, that, hope that door stays open long enough for this old man to make his way through. Ah, I forgot we had to go back down the stairs. There goes by Tuesday. We'll have to wait till Wednesday to finish this puzzle. Oh, well. Y'all need to stop quacking at me. I swear to God. You quacking me one more time. You're about to be Peking Duck for dinner, motherfucker. Can I just jump out this window and escape my sad life? If that predator tries to come at me one more time, I swear to God, I'm gonna sick Arnold Schwarzenegger and Jesse Ventura on his bitch ass. And that other guy that I don't remember his name. Carl Weathers? Is that his name? Fucking... The weatherman himself? I think that's his name. I don't remember. All I know is Predator. That's a cool movie. Back in my day, Predator was... There was only one Predator. Not this newfangled multiple Predator thing. 
If you try to scream at me one more time, I'm trying to tell a story over here, young whippersnapper. If you interrupt me with that scream one more time, I swear, I swear, I swear, I will throw this nasty ass sausage wrapped in a condom right in your ear. And that's a promise from old man fuck, motherfucker. Oh, God, you're gonna throw my back out. I'm trying to pull this across the room. You're trying to break this old man with these puddles right now, video game? How dare you? <whistles> Pretty sure that's a condom wrapped sausage. And if you don't think so, maybe I got two words for you. Suck it. Yeah, back in my day, that's how we insulted people and told them what to do. Give them two words and tell them to suck it. Give him that good old crotch chop. It was good times. I'll throw some pepper on this bitch. All right, I'm gonna stop with the old man voice. I think we're good. <sighs> you think the context of a kid actually being a frail old man makes the game way funnier? <laughs> it's funny. You're not gonna suck a sausage in a condom, Martin? Man. Such a prude. Oh, shit. I'm about to murder another child. What are these sound effects I hear, by the way? It sounds like there's a fucking mob out here. Are you guys ready to whack this fool? Get fucked! Oh, yeah? You want some too? You want some too? Get fucked! Oh, I missed. I'm dead. <laughs> Shit. Depth perception for the lose. <laughs> Damn. Would you suck on the sausage if it wasn't in a condom? Like, if it started in a condom, then we took the condom off, would you suck on the sausage then? I've wandered into Freddy's domain. Get fucked! You want some too? Get fucked! Oh yeah? We're going three for the three for your money? Get fucking Oh, there's four! Overkill. <laughs> nice. <laughs> the victory music, though. <laughs> Woo. Little Easter egg. There was a room to the left that had a lunch lady's corpse in it. Oh, did it? Ah, I missed that. Dang it. There is a quite a clamor going on over here. Oh, shit. Am I supposed to go out here? Because this feels unsafe. What? Oh, shit! <laughs> that was not a good idea. I didn't even mean to do that. Oh, my God. Better lock your door indeed. You know what the best type of spoon is? Eh, I'll tell you later. Oh, my God, DJ. Please. Police. Call the police. Damn. Oh, come on, man. Stop with the depth perception failures. Old man fuck his left. Depth perception should be back now. <sighs> Hit me with that fail trumpet. I see how it is. <clears throat> I see how it is. There we go. I just gotta wait for him to, like, stop and, like, gather their fucking senses for a second. All right, there we go. Oh, I get it. I was supposed to take his head. That's why it thwacked off so cleanly. Now it all makes sense. Okay, that makes more sense. You gonna make me do the fucking Freddy, Freddy thing? All right, I'll do it. Fuck it. One, two, Freddy's coming for you. Three, four, better lock your door. Five, six, grab your crucifix. Seven, eight, better stay up late. Nine, ten, never sleep again. Uh, anyway, let's, uh... That ladle cause quite a stir. Oof. You know what? <laughs> You know what else causes quite a stir? Me joining the party. What a- What? Bitch! I thought we could be friends. 
Listen to this ruckus going on here. It's very unsettling. These children are fucking nuts. Y'all a bunch of fucking nuts. I'm just gonna go, you bunch of nutty fucks. You better leave me alone. Damn, there's hella kids up in this bitch. Jesus. If I had the weapons, I would go Freddy Krueger on their ass. I would. Oh, shit! He literally just murdered me. He literally just murdered me. What a fuck. I was one of you, man! How did you know? Asshole. He did get my ass. That was not cool. Not too. Also, we are having pizza today, which means we're definitely going to have a pizza break before I, you know, before the stream is over. Because I don't know how long this game's really going to take me, but we're going to have a pizza break. Shit! I forgot! How could I forget? How could I forget? It just happened. I was busy talking about pizza. Fuck me. I mean, these kids literally are murdering each other. Sort of. I mean, they're, they're definitely torturing each other. That much is true. I'm actually not sure what kind of pizza she ordered. I'll have to check. I just told her she knows what I like, and you'll get. And I trust. I trust her judgment. <clears throat> I'm assuming she got Domino's pizza. If you're wondering, like, what she ordered it from, but I didn't check that yet either. Anyway, this looks like a fun time. This is a fun time. I don't want to be here anymore. Can we just go? Because fuck these children. They're fucking terrifying and they're murdering each other. I don't want to. I don't want to anymore. Please save me. Oh, shit. Well, I guess we're not going back out there. Not that I want to. Oh, back to my bucket head. Can head. Tin head. Whatever. Anyway, let me see if I have info on the pizza situation. Oh. <clears throat> Nope, she just said she ordered it, and she also got some boneless chicken wings, which is pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. All right, climbing up here. Can you come over? Uh, if you could make it in time, Frog, sure. But something tells me by the time you get here, there will be no pizza left. It will be already gone. They're singing the tune on the TV from the first game. Is that what they're singing? I don't even remember the tune on the TV from the first game, to be fair, Scorilla. I, I kind of watched Morrow play Little Nightmares like a week ago, but I didn't pay attention to the whole playthrough. I missed like the last third of the game. So I don't remember that. I probably should have like looked at my own playthrough, but I haven't. I basically have never rewatched my original playthrough when I did this, what, a couple years ago? It was at least two or three years ago. And it was kind of an un it was kind of a forgettable run because it was just like a two hour sitting in of the game. I would say the first game in this didn't stick with me super hard, other than a couple key moments. Obviously, um, I'm, am I here to collect somebody's brain? Uh, yeah, okay. This game's a fair bit longer. Oh yeah. I I know, the first one's super short. I literally ran through it in like two hours on a first try. It was like two hours and 15 minutes. And that was the first time I ever played it. Wait. Wait. What? Was I supposed to throw the brain down here? Oh, I might have fucked up, y'all. I might have fucked up. Hold up. I might have forgot. Ah, oh, man. I mean, I didn't really know what I was climbing up here for in the first place. Hold up. <clears throat> Yeah. 
I didn't really forget to throw down the brain. I just didn't. All right. Use that big brain. I know. I know. I know. Trust me, Martin. I, I, I didn't realize it was going to take me all the way down. I truly didn't know. If I would have known, I probably wouldn't have done that. Anyway, now I'm big brain. Forever. Wait. Wait. Am I really going to throw a brain at a switch? That's the object we're going to use. That's hilarious. If there was ever a time to use your brain to figure out the puzzle, that's the most literal interpretation I've ever heard. Ever seen. Also, oh god. If I only had a brain. It's time to deal with crazy long neck deep throat BZ again. Yay. I'm just looking to see if there's anything else in this room. <coughs> All right, here comes the fun. All right, well, I took too long, but hopefully it's enough time for me to get over here. You didn't see me. You didn't see me. You only thought you saw me. You didn't see shit. <coughs> <coughs> shit. Hurry before she comes back. Is she coming back? I have no idea. Well, we're going to find out the hard way. Actually, before I do that, can I go up on the counter? Is there anything up here that I want? Anything that would qualify as a, as a hat? Anything I... Oh, uh, you know what? Maybe I'm supposed to do something with this. Maybe I got to push it down and, like, actually aggro her. Or not? I don't seem to be able to interact with it, actually. Surprisingly. Well, then never mind. <clears throat> if I only had a brain. If I wasn't such a dummy, I'd feel a little less crummy if I only had a brain. Okay, maybe I am supposed to aggro her, because I can't seem to push that door. Yep, thanks for that, Frog, for getting that stuck into my fucking head. Maybe I'm just supposed to push it down instead of left. Or not? I'm so confused. This is the only thing that stands out on the whole counter. Unless I'm supposed to hit it with something. Maybe I can hit it with... Maybe I can grab the knife over here. Hold up. Can I grab this? No? No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, okay. Can I grab any of this stuff? If you want a song to replace that earworm, oh god, here we go. <clears throat> Oh, the fucking Deadly Premonition song. The <laughs> you know what I noticed? I was watching the Game Grumps play that game. Like, they they played that a long time ago. But I was re I was went back and watched their Let's Play a little bit of it. Not the whole thing, but some of it. And. Uh, <clears throat> They're like, is that the fucking, is that the Super Mario World song? I was like, what, like the, but it's slowed down in whistle form, like it's just slow. I was like, it kind of sounds like it. Maybe I'm supposed to use this brain for something. Maybe I'm not. <clears throat> I'm missing something here. Let me make sure I can't open this door and I'm not being stupid. So I try to push it. It's just not happening. What am I missing? 
It's gotta be something with this fucking jar. I have to do something to it. This is stupid. What am I doing? <clears throat> There's gotta be something to break it. Or something. It's gotta be. Can't climb up there. <clears throat> What am I supposed to do? Can I climb up in this cabinet, dude? Can I just like jump on this jar and it'll break? Like something, anything? Like seriously, what the fuck? I mean, my bitch is looking up like I'm supposed to look up or something, but I don't understand. Does this make enough noise? No. <sighs> I don't understand what I'm missing. This feels like it shouldn't be this, this hard. What am I missing? What's the thing on the floor? The brain that I left on the floor? There's nothing else on the floor other than the brain. <clears throat> That's the brain I brought from the other room. But I can't, like, throw it up on the counter. Or at least I've been trying. And maybe I'm using the wrong angle. I don't seem to be able to throw it high enough. It's getting kind of annoying. No wonder you can't figure it out. You left your brains on the floor. I don't seem to be able to throw it high enough to get up there. Throw it at the door. Key up! I think I did that already. <laughs> I'm just not able to throw it high enough. <clears throat> so I'm a little bit... Um, stumped at the moment. What am I not interacting with? I can't go back at all. This is where we're at. We're here. This is the place. I feel like this fucking jar is supposed to be interacted with, but I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Really? It's not letting me go through here, though. Wait. What? Yeah, dude, it's not like letting me go through though. What the fuck just happened? Did I aggro her and I didn't even see it? Did Maybe I broke it. Maybe I broke it. I was thinking the same thing. I was like, maybe this is broken. Let me restart from the checkpoint and see if I just broke the door. Because I tried to push and squeeze by the door, but it didn't work. What the fuck? Well, I guess I was right. Or you were right about that. It was broken. Because now we're in here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yoy. Cool game. Well, now we know it was in here. I'm assuming I can't just like, oh fuck. Stay away from me. Stay away from me. I, need to, I think I need to go on the tables and jump through that thing up there on the wall over there on the right. I think I need to go up to do that though. Okay. I think I, I think I, I think I have that right. So we definitely need to climb up here. Wow, I'm kind of mad that that soft locked on me. That was fucking lame. Makes me feel like I was being dumb, but I wasn't. It was just the game not working, which is the best. Am I right? Oh shit! I got stuck. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to slide. Ah! Oh, shit. Run like hell.
Did I lose her? I did not lose her. Uh. <laughs> All right. Well, if I wouldn't have fucked up in the, the beginning part, I might have been able to make that, but I fucked up. <laughs> it's fine. What? What a bitch. Oh, my God. What a bitch. Didn't even let me climb up there before you fucking aggroed, you bitch. Quack. Don't be quacking at me. <clears throat> Alright. Yeah, not a fan of the way she moves either, man. Shit is unsettling. I'll wait till I have a moment. What? What? That's not cool, game. This is some bullshit, man. Some straight up bullshit. I tell you what. Can a man, a, a baby kid man, just climb up in peace and not be chased for his actions? All right, we're in, we're in there. We're up here and we're in there. We wait for her to move. What? Man, you're a piece of shit. You know that lady? You're a real piece of shit. All right, maybe maybe now we're okay. All right, here we go. Is this a safe spot? I feel like this isn't gonna be safe. Gotta put the heart back in place, bitch. You did it. Congratulations. Now what are you doing? Oh fuck. I didn't mean to aggro that bitch. Going. I'm out bitch. See you. Oh, the fucking move player. Oh, we're fucked. <laughs> ah. I don't know where we're supposed to go from there. <laughs> I think I was supposed to climb the bookshelf, actually. Damn it. If I would have known, I might have been able to get away, but I, I didn't know. I didn't look at it fast enough. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. All right, turn around and grab that heart, and then I'm going to go. I don't know what you're doing now, but stop it. <laughs> See ya. I'm out, bitch. Oh, shit. Well, I was out, and then that happened. Oh, shit. No. No. See ya. <laughs> ah! God damn it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I didn't mean to aggro her. Oh, fuck. Well, that was good. Well, you know what? I'll take the L because I accidentally jumped when I, when I spawned. Just eat me. Just fucking eat me. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> this bitch, though. Okay. Hey, thank you for the follow, Swift Bananas. Appreciate it. So quit quacking at me. Shit. Oh shit, she didn't see me though. I aggroed, but she didn't see me. That's good. I'm okay with this.
Yo. Oh shit, no. Ah shit, dude. No. Damn it. How's it going, Swoop Bananas? It's going all right. This room is ruining me, though. It's not even that I'm scared. I just can't get it down. God, I was so close. I should have. I shouldn't attempted fate. I should have just did it right. Damn it. That's okay. We'll get this down eventually. God damn it. This fucking lady, though, is pissing me off. <clears throat> All right. <sighs> da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, we haven't done the giveaway yet. I think if, if and when I do pizza break, it's giveaway time. Stay ducked, stay ducked. Hold on. Hold on. Yo, I did it. Hell yeah. How long does pizza delivery take out there in the sticks? It doesn't take that long. It just depends on if my sister's going to go pick it up or if they're delivering it. I'm assuming they're going to go pick it up. She'll let me know when it gets here. Anyway. We are victorious, bitchin. Ow, and now we're dead. <laughs> but anyway, Swift Bananas, how are you doing today? Thank you for popping in. Thank you for the follow again, and uh, hopefully you're having a good day. Oh shit, is it hammer time again? It's fucking hammer time, bitch. Oh, motherfucker. Apparently it's bucket time. God damn it, I didn't know. I was too excited about it being hammer time. All right, hold up. That's right, bitch. Tamer time. Oh. Well. My depth perception has failed me again. That wasn't even depth perception. That was just bad timing. Yeah. Fucking get clonked, you little bitch. Get clonked, little bitch. Can't touch this. Da 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 da. Da -da. Da -da -da -da. I don't have my hammer though. I feel like there's more. Pick the hammer back up. There we go. Anybody else wants a fucking wants a fucking piece? I feel like a killer just dragging a hammer down the fucking hall like I'm coming to murder you. You fucks. Oh there we go. Come at me, bitch. Try me, bitch! Try me, bitch. Makes me wonder if all these traps were meant for the teacher and they're just being little shits. Who knows, man? Also, which one of y'all took a piss on this carpet right here? I'll break your face. Did we miss the quack? Oh, I heard a quack. I definitely heard a quack. Oh, shit. Oh, the, the accidental... Early nailed it. Let's go. Okay, there's definitely another bucket trap here. You ain't getting me. Oh, there's not? Alright, well there is one, but it's coming up next. Hold on. It's on the next plank over here. Okay, so that one came from the door. And that's fine. I still hear this music, so I'm keeping my hammer in hand. Oh, yeah. Dude, what are y'all doing? Y'all are fucked up. Wait. Oh, no, that's my homie. Oh. I swung the wrong way. Damn it. Okay, at least it gave me the checkpoint. That's good. I accidentally, like, f spun around and didn't do the correct fucking fucking maneuver. Fuck you, you piece of shit. All right, there's my homie. Okay, I don't want to just break this because he'll fall on his fucking head and die. I got to help him. I got you, homie. I got you. Don't worry. I'm coming to save you. 
It's going to be me and you, Holmes. Today you learn that funky swings that way. Yeah, the wrong way. Or am I... Dude, I feel like if I do this, he's going to land on his head and die. I don't want to do it. That doesn't feel like a good idea. He's going to die. He's going to die. And he's dead. I killed him. I murdered him. I dropped him on his head and he's dead. Why would you make, why would you make me do it that way, game? Oh, he's alive. Never mind. I take it all back. He lives. Oh, are we moving again? Sorry, I got distracted. Well, guys, me and my friend are reunited once again. Let's get the fuck out of here, huh? Come on, friendo. Reunited and it feels so good. We got through this school like I knew we would. Let's get the fuck out of here just like we should. Yay. All right. Oh, this looks safe. Time for some Piano Man. Don't let me do this, because I'll do this all day long. I like how I got an achievement for that, by the way. I did. I did get an achievement for that. That was incredible. Okay. Am I climbing the rope? Maybe. No? Maybe not? Uh, okay. Time to play some Alice Cooper! Oh, shit. I actually did make that jump. Incredibly. Alright, well, I don't know what the piano's for. Oh, wait, there's a crank back here. Hello. Oh. Am I supposed to send my homie up on that? Or is he supposed to send me up on that? I don't know yet. Let me see what's over here first, if there's anything. Is this just a closed door? Oh, it's just a closed door. Okay, so this is the puzzle. Noted. All right, what if I tell him to go over here? You, come here. Come here. Here. Can you hold this crank for me, bruh? 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 Okay, he's not going to do the crank. Can you come up here, then? Unless I'm supposed to just lift the piano all the way up and then it does a thing. All right, hold on. Let's just see what happens when I crank it all the way. I got 26 achievement. I don't know what that means. You know what you get if you drop a piano on a child? Oh, God. No, I don't, DJ, but I have a feeling you're going to tell me. Okay. Apparently, that's what I need to do. A flat minor. Nice. So I don't think I can lift him up anymore. So I think we're just stuck. Oh, I see. We're going to do the stomp game again. We did it! Now we're dead. Oh, God. Well, we don't have any flat miners, but we do have progress with another fucking locked door. Awesome. All right. <clears throat> All right, time to lift me up, homeboy. Let's go. Oh, okay. It's another one of these fucking murdersome little bitches. Ah, oh, he played distraction. GG. GG, homie. And... Murdered! See ya. <laughs> I love it. I guess I have to we have to lift up this grating, I'm assuming. T 
Teamwork makes the dream work, player. Just long enough for me to get in there. All right. Got that key pretty easily. Let's go. Easy sauce. Oh, well. Who's ready to murder another one of these players? Wait. Are you really just going to choke that kid out? Oh, savage. Okay, homie. I see how it is. He just assassins Creed that fucker. He's like, choke him out. Choke him out. That was dark. That was some dark shit, but okay. I think homie might be in a little bit of a mess mentally. He looks like he's like a changed man after he choked that guy out. Can I hammer the homie? I mean, I could probably, but I don't think I want to. Also, somebody actually playing this piano? Or is this just the music for this part? Nope, the piano stopped. Oh, kept going. There's not a lot going on here. I guess we're going up the stairs. Uh, somebody's definitely playing that piano live. We're going to meet them soon. In fact, are you going to lift me up? You can lift me up. I know that I can climb this shit. You better go and hide your dick. Because I'm about to push this shit right down. Oh. Oh, that was blocking my way to be able to climb up here. I get it. It's a dead Billy Joel, is it though? I don't know. We're not gonna. We're not gonna know forever. Quack at me one more time. <clears throat> oh, fuck that! Look who's playing. Look who's playing. Of course it's her. Why would it be anyone else? I love that she did the exorcist. Fuck it. Oh, shit. Well, oh my god, I'm alive. I literally fell from the top of the fucking room and I'm alive. Well, I don't think that's how I was supposed to get down, but that's how I did it. <laughs> okay. Well, good times. It's time to crank that. True dad. The 360 with her head was not the weirdest thing she ever did. So am I supposed to climb back up there? I'm guessing so. Yes, great song. Write it down. How the hell am I supposed to get back up? I don't even know how I got down. Wait. Question. Can I move this thing? I probably can. Oh yeah, I totally can. Okay. So we need to use this to get across. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. I know what to do. I'm going to wait for the next, wait for the next pause, then we're going to go for it. Go, go, go. Why would you push it that way? Oh, fuck that. Oh, we fucked up. She literally... <laughs> what a bitch. She literally pinned me in between the chair and the thing.
I think I pushed it too close to her. I didn't realize I could like 360 pull it. I was just trying to pull it to the side. Oh fuck, I have to do the crank again. Ah, whatever. It's fine. This is the harder part. Hold up. That's as far as that goes anyway. So while she's playing, I can run. My, the little pitter-patter of my footsteps. Don't aggro her. Would you let go? That was absurd. Hold on, we're almost there. We're almost there. Just start playing one more time and then we're out of this bitch. Key up. Alright. Just walk slow. Let's get the fuck out of here. See ya. Oh god. Get in the hole! Holy shit! That's terrifying. Oh, that's fucking terrifying. Are you serious? That is terrifying. Oh my god. Do not. Do not even. That's not even cool, man. That is not cool. Holy shit, dude. That bitch. She's fucking crazy. She's 100% dead bitch. God damn. Okay. Okay. Well then. Apparently her neck literally stands forever. I don't want to see her again. I hope we don't. When can I see you again? Hopefully never. When can I see you again? <laughs> 